guys and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be doing my skincare and hair care routine all wrapped in one video so you don't have to go to two separate videos, but also because I don't really use that much product, so I figured it would work all really well in all one video rather than splitting it up into two separate videos. So we're going to start off with my skincare. For my skincare, um, I actually did post a video like a year ago, I think it was, um, on my skincare. I was using clean and clear products and um, different cleansers and things like that. Most of it was clean and clear though. I am not trying to bash clean and clear at all. I think that what happened was I just needed a change in my skincare and I've been using it so much that I think the product got used to my skin and wasn't really working as well. So I do recommend that brand. The brand is amazing. But this is my new go-to and it's a lot more simple, I think. I don't know. I guess it's the same amount of um, products. But my go-to at the moment has been for um, if I wanted like deep clean my face, like really wash my face um, after like a full face of makeup or anything like that. I have been using the Pixie and Carolyn uh, Hirons um, double cleanser face wash and it's the best product I have used in a long time. I love this product. All you do is it tells you you use the solid cleansing oil first and you use the cleansing cream after that. So what I do is I use the solid oil to take off all of my makeup. And if you watch 11th Gorgeous's videos, um, they recently, or not recently, they did it a couple months ago. Um, they did a video showing the brand Pons that has this cleanser that literally wipes all of your makeup off. It's amazing, but this also does this trick and it's just, I really like this product a lot better. Um, I did try that other product as well and I prefer this one over it but um, basically there's a solid side of the product and then more a more like moisturizer looking side like a cream and basically what I do is I put the solid cleanser or the so solid cleansing oil all over my face to get rid of all of my makeup and then I um, then I wash that all off then I apply I got something in my eyeball um, then I apply the cleansing cream over that and let that sit on my face for a minute and then wipe it all clean and all off with water again. Then I go and I apply my go-to moisturizer that has been my go-to for a couple of months now. It is the Origins Ginseng um, Energy Boosting Moisturizer, which I do have a big pack of, but I am currently still going through the little travel pack that I have. When I was using, when I was doing my old makeup, um, skincare routine, I was using the clean and clear makeup wipes to get rid of any like residue of makeup or anything like that. And I think a lot of it was that my skin was getting used to the product, so I had to kind of switch it up. So lately, I have been using the new Aveeno Active Natural um, Positively Radiant Makeup Removing Wipes. And these, this is my first bag and I'm like almost out of them. These things are amazing. I love, love, love these makeup wipes so much. I think I like them a little bit more better than the Clean and Clear ones. A lot of people actually prefer the Neutrogena ones over the Clean and Clear. I've, I've kind of heard through different YouTube people. Um, but yes, this has been my go-to lately. So, if you're looking for a new skincare routine, I highly recommend this item, these makeup wipes and the Origins moisturizer for your face. It's amazing and I love these products for my face. Moving on to hair care, I, as along with my skin care, I also only use three products for my hair. So when I go to wash my hair, which I just did like a couple of hours ago, um, I like to switch it up every once in a while. So um, weekly, I will, once a week, I will do a purple shampoo in my hair to keep the color that I have um, between uh, when I go to the hair salon. Um, so
So I've been using the Matrix uh, Total Results So Silver Color Obsessed Purple Shampoo. It is like dark purple. And I will say that on the back of it, I find it funny that it says that you need to wear gloves when you apply this because it, it will stain. But it actually does not stain at all. Just letting you guys know if you want to try this product out. So yeah, so this product is amazing and I love it. And I only use that um, once a week because you don't need to do, the, do this too much to your hair. Um, but also, so my um, shampoo and conditioner that I use, I recently just started using these like a month or month and a half ago or so. I um, used to use, if I think, no, I, have, I don't think I've talked about this yet. Um, I used to use the Paul Mitchell Tea Tree Oil um, shampoo and conditioner. And I also used... Along with that, I would switch up with the um, the cleansing, uh, what is it called? It's from Suave, and it is like a 99 cent, it's like a deep cleanser, like it's basically just kind of like clarifying, that's what it is, not cleansing, clarifying shampoo from Suave, but what I found out, I recently went to a, um, when I, last time I went to, to go get my hair done, I was asking my hair um, dresser about what shampoos and conditioners should I be using because I felt like the stuff that I was using wasn't really working well anymore as it was when I first started using it and basically what she was telling me was that I need to stop using clarifying shampoo on my hair because my hair is very oily and so if I'm using clarifying shampoo it's trying to build back that oil and and overpower it so she told me to pick up a um sulfate free hair care, uh, or shampoo and conditioner sulfate free, and also um, volumizing. So I decided to try out, this one's a little bit messed up, but um, like it's a little squished, but um, I decided to try the L'Oreal Ever Pure Sulfate Free Color Care System Lotus, and it's the volume shampoo and volume conditioner. And these two products, as you can tell, I've literally been using these for a while now and they also are 100% vegan they're amazing and they just bring life to my hair because before my hair was very I just got like stuff all as all over my there's like stuff all over this okay we're just gonna set those to the side um I actually what my hair just would not come off my scalp and would just look very very dull and very not there I guess so since switching to this my hair has been lifted off of my scalp scalp lifted off of my scalp and actually I really like the way that it looks now so that being said that is how I do my hair I like to um, brush it out with a wet brush and then I um, use a different brush to blow dry I blow dry my hair I never really do I never really like leave my hair naturally like let it dry naturally I usually just um blow dry it after I wash it and that's how I do my hair I never like put it in braids and then go to sleep or anything like that I just completely just blow dry my hair every single time so that is how I do my hair that is all I have for you guys today if you like this video give this video a thumbs up and let me know down below um if you use any of these products and um what your hair care or skin care is and routine is and then also just leave me comments about what videos you would like to see next so I will see you guys in my next video